Hello my planner pals and welcome back. And if you're new here then thank you for joining me and giving me a try. My name is Di, I am here at Creative Karma Design and today I've got a two-part video for you, something that I'm going to just try out and see how it goes. This is me decorating my dashboard planner for the week of the 7th and I'm using the stickers from the grabby Halloween box because it's these little houses. I took far too long deciding which of the little houses that I wanted to use and then far too long deciding whether I was going to use washi tape, like what I was going to use. It took way too freaking long and I kept getting interrupted and all of that. So I'm just going to fast forward and do a brief overview of the plan with me. So basically I chose three houses. I finally chose some washi tape, <laughs> finally, and then I, then I changed the color of the washi tape later on. I knew that I had a few things that I needed to put in. I needed to put in a cleaning list. I have a project like class that I'm doing on Friday. I am doing a weekend project. This is my new, my new thing. I'm gonna try and do a weekend project every other weekend in the house. So the one for the weekend of the 12th is gonna be cleaning the patio off and giving it a good clear off for fall. I needed a to-do list. And then I have my regular stuff that I have going on that week. So I used, again, washi tape. The house stickers are from the Grabby Halloween box. And then all of the other stickers are from the productivity books. And they're old productivity books. These are from 2016. I've had them in my stash for a while. And if there's like black stickers that I need, then I will generally go in there and check those out. So yes, in the hindsight, I wish I'd have chose one of the bottom right houses, a different house. I just feel that that's the wrong blue, but we move on, we move on. So yeah, this took far too long to do, but what I want to do in the second part of this video is show you how I use my planner and set it up for the week ahead. So that is what I'm going to do in the second half of this video. There will be a timestamp down below that you can see that. So yeah, if you want to go straight to that, then check it out.
All right, welcome back. It is the second half of this video, which will be me filling in as much as I can for next week. So I just put in some little um, dots, like little to-do dots, checklist dots. This is with the Pilot G2.7, just a metallic pen. I love this pen. Um, you know that I love the Pilot G2s. I just love them. They're my favorite pen. So yes, if you're interested, I will leave links to pens and stuff that I can down below. So check those out. It does help me out if you use my links. I'm going to fill in using the Pilot G2.38. I'm doing this because I feel if I used a thicker pen that it would detract from the stickers. I want the pen to just fill in the background and not be in your face. In your face. And that's how you do in your face as a thing, in your face. So this is how I use my dashboard. I've seen a few people online in the groups recently talking about switching to a dashboard. And I just wanted to go over, because I used to use a vertical, how I use a dashboard for my main planner. I have my dailies here. This is my day stuff. If it has to happen on this day, it goes in here. This I use as my kind of YouTube channel overview, what I have going up each day. And that is what I use mine for. You could use yours for exercise. It could be meal planning. It could be gratitude. Anything can go in here. What I could have done was put one of the houses in there, but I use this bit. So the other thing that I need, again, I have that project box. I've got a to-do list. And then I've got another to-do list here. This is usually for business, like, Etsy and like working on a website, etc., etc., And then here, generally it will be a brain dump list. Anything that comes into my head during the week, I've mentioned this before, I like to have it as a brain dump. What do I need? What do I need to get out of my head and onto paper? So, and again, overflow goes into a journal or into the back of my planner. So I'm going to fill in what I can. I know that Wednesday is trash day. So I'm just going to put in, I'm just trying to decide where I want to put that above or below. Mm -hmm. Don't know. Now I'm, now I'm in freeze mode. Freeze mode. I'm going to put, um, I'm going to put that here purely because if I can find another sticker like this, it's going in there because I want my email box in there. I just couldn't find one earlier, but I know that I have more of these. I just don't know what box, which book they're in. Jo Jen's birthday. I can take that off. We're going to put trash day and recycle. Here I've got... I'm just trying to think. Ali Edwards class. No, oh, that's not how you spell class. If I could spell, we would be winning here. December daily hybrid. So I want to take the day off. That is my goal for this day. Appointment. 11 a.m. Skype with mom and dad. And then this will be December daily digi kits. Weekend. Project, clean and tidy back patio. So those are the things, the things that I have to do. I've got Manny Petty here. I'm going to put this there just because why not? Here I want to do a little task on my Amazon storefront. That is for there. And then We've got here, um, 
house cleaning and normally there's like six things I'm going to try and condense them down oh you know what I could do hang on let's put more little stars in there we go that's how you fix that the top three is now top five sheets back mop dust and doors trash and poop oh that's the other thing that i need to put in and sorry i'm just thinking about things as i'm going trash and poop and paperwork filed then i will put in workout as my other top priority and i want you to let me know if this is helpful for any of you as you're maybe transitioning to dashboard and that will be the only thing that i plan on sunday okay so that is that the other thing that i wanted to put in was i did that here so that'd be one two three it will be here do um poop bin empty because doing it once a week is not enough now that i've got two dogs let me tell you let me tell you then my habit for this month of october is to declutter so i'm just going to put that in here and then what i will do is put in monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday Sunday. Now you could do this. I've done it as a cleaning list. I've done it as a regular task list. It's been a grocery list, any kind of thing. But that is my October goal is to declutter and I will put in what I've done rather than do it ahead of time because I did it ahead of time on my daily page yesterday. And I was like, oh, I'm going to declutter because I've done my closet. I've done the drawers. I wanted to do the drawers underneath the bed. That was me pulling the drawers underneath the bed in case you're wondering. And then I ended up doing something different and did the living room table and my laptop table in there. And now it's all gone to hell in a handbasket. So yes, um, here I'm going to put in weekly, weekly tutorial, tutorial project life and then the only other thing I think is to find a sticker for here for email and that's all I can do right now depending on how much else I get done this week pretty sure that's uh, uh, that's all I can do um, just thought of something you know what i'm just going to put it in here if we find something else to go in there then that's great but if other than that it's fine email to you oh just thought about something else see i can't even okay i'm just looking at last week that so far is all i can write in but that's how i think about it these are things that i want to do on that day these are things that i want to get done in the week and again normally my task list goes here but i put these in my weekly and then regretted it so i'm just going to fill it in after the fact this week what did i do on monday i did the pantry what did i do this day i did the laundry area what did i do this day i did the front porch or i did some stuff in the garden um the other thing that i do put in is um zone cleaning so um i could put in clean kitchen clean laundry clean dining because what I've started to do is an hour Monday Wednesday and Friday like I am all over right now time blocking and it works until I rebel and hate the structure but I need the structure for my brain to work so yes 
Um, but that is all I can put in right now until Sunday where I will fill in as I go on each day and fill in this. But yeah, that is as much as I can put in right now. So I hope you enjoyed this kind of different video of showing you how I fill in after the pen. That's basically what I do and how I use the dashboard. Daily things here have to be done on that day and then weekly things on here. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already and I will see you next time my planner pals. Bye!